Hi, my name is Arushi. Um, I'm from New Delhi in India. I'm currently a PhD candidate at Johns Hopkins School of Public Health and Health Systems. I am trying to understand what are the organizational determinants of motivation among primary healthcare workers in Nigeria. I've been based in Nigeria for about two years now. Um, I also work with the World Bank uh, here. I'm helping them uh, with technical assistance on designing and implementing the impact evaluation of a results-based financing project for health that the government of India with the World Bank is preparing to initiate in three pilot states. I'm from, as I said, I'm from New Delhi. I did my undergraduate degree in economics from the University of Delhi. Then I studied at University of Cambridge. Again, I studied economics there. Um, I went back home and worked in India with an organization called the Public Health Foundation of India. I was a part of their research team looking at issues on healthcare financing, economics, health systems. Um, most of the research projects that I worked on were on, health, on the health workforce in India. Um, after that, I went. I started my PhD at Johns Hopkins University, and um, it's been challenging. <laughs> but I'm, I'm almost. I want to say I'm almost there. Um, I, I was based in Baltimore for about a year and a half, and I completed my coursework. And um, then I moved to Abuja, where I've been work, where I've been for the last couple of years. Um, First, actually, to do my research work, but then subsequently, I stayed back to work with the World Bank here as well. Hi, uh, I think this is a great time to be working in development and particularly in research. Um, there are a lot of opportunities out there, and I'm not speaking just in terms of research um, attached to universities or academics, but also a lot of donor agencies are looking for researchers, a lot of policy makers are looking for evidence-based um, data so that they can support their policies. Um, I think it's important for, so it's important to get hands-on experience of research. Um, my advice would be to start small, um, try working with smaller um, NGOs or think tanks that are doing research. Always better to start working in a team. I think that's uh, the best way that you learn. Um, and of course, the closer you are to the ground realities, the more you learn as a researcher. Um, I think context is really important and uh, looking for opportunities within either the countries or the communities that you want to study or want to understand, those would be, that would be you know, the best way to go about in terms of learning the most.